well, for the next week. The women's college basketball world will be dedicated to honoring the life and legacy of the game's greatest coach. Lady Vol legend Pat Summit. Uh, Will Puckett shows us the impact We Back Pat Week has in the fight against Alzheimer's, of course, the disease that cut her life short. You gotta switch it. You gotta switch to cover the three. Take care of the ball. What does it take to get a foul? It's a legacy that'll last far beyond the hardwood floor of a basketball court. Her name um, is known throughout the country, and so then being able to use um, her story to fight the battle and to help all of those other families. For the next week across the landscape of women's college basketball, the life and legacy of Pat Summit will be honored through the work of fighting Alzheimer's. The We Back Pat Week is really a, an awareness week, so it just gives us an opportunity to, to talk. So Morgan Vance is the Director of Advancement at the Pat Summit Foundation. Through this week, she and her colleagues will travel the country, bringing light to the work being done in the battle against Alzheimer's. This week being an awareness week, it really gives us an opportunity to start a conversation about um, not just the Pat Summit Foundation and about Coach Summit and her legacy and her battle, but it allows us to bring um, the conversation to life about all of the families that are battling it every single day. The seven days are spent working to educate people on the impacts of the disease, on the nearly six million people fighting it, and the nearly 11 million Americans supporting them. A lot of people, just when they think of Alzheimer's disease or dementia, they think of it simply as, oh, well, my loved one might forget who I am, or they might forget my name, and they don't realize how much it impacts um, the person over the span of the disease. As her name and image will be shown throughout the week, Coach Summit is remembered for more than just the X's and O's between the opening tip and the final horn. I really hope that they they take that into consideration. If Pat wanted to make a difference in this disease and she wanted to take care of our patients and she wanted to take care of the caregivers, um, and so I just I hope that they um, that just kind of calls them to action of what what can they do to help in that fight in Knoxville. Will Puckett, WVLT News. And if you'd like to help the Pat Summit Foundation, we have a link with information in your WVLT News app.